So this is what I'm using. It's a soft plastic. You just want to jig it around underneath these poles. And you'll catch nice Australian sun. They're under these poles. See so if you can get one. See one just come up there. They had a look. Right guys, so it looks like an Australian salmon. I don't know though, there's a really big one following it. You can see that. Right, we'll pull him up. Got it. Right, so this is the car wire, they call it here in New Zealand. But this is the Australian salmon. Right, so this is called the Australian salmon. They call it here Kawaii in New Zealand, but look at him, he's a nice fish. Now this is legal size, so we can keep him, and we'll probably see how they taste, because apparently they don't taste very good, but I'm willing to test it for you guys. So, yeah, the Kawaii. So they're like, they sort of look like a small tuna, so they can move through water pretty well, but yeah, so we'll cook him up. Oh, there we go, got him. Now we've already got a salmon to eat, so we're probably not going to eat this guy. Oh, he's underneath those rocks. Oh no. Hey, he's out, he's out. Come on, this is a big one. Tighten up the drag a little bit. Seems to be pulling me. Alright, we'll pull him up. No, 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 no. Come on. Yes. Alright, that's a bigger specimen. But yeah. That's another Australian salmon. This is just the same species as we're gonna cook up. It looks like eel. Mm, got me. Just soaking in that butter. I hope it take, makes it taste good. Isaac's not here to see, to be here for this catch and cook. So this is Australian salmon. To be honest, I'm not really keen because it looks like eel. But you know, let's give it a try. Now I can see why people don't like them. They're edible, but I wouldn't be raving on. So there you have it, Australian salmon. So subscribe, see ya.